Welcome to View by Deidre's BRC. I want to say thank you to Great Hobbies for letting me do this. Go visit the website. Today we have one of the newest vehicles from Arma. It's the Arma Gorgon, Gorgon, Gugun, something, something. <laughs> uh, it's, it is a weird name. It is a 110 scale. And it's a little bit on the monster truck side, I would say, but that's my opinion. Um, it is a 550 mega brush motor in it. Uh, what can I say? Uh, it is in the, I'm not gonna lie, in the lower end of Armas, but again, you still get the greatest warranty out there. Uh, you get stuff that you cannot expect from other companies. <clears throat> It comes with a high power six seven cell battery included a one s no no one s sorry uh smart charger it's the s one twenty it's not the greatest charger out there. I'll be honest with you if you want something better, go ahead grab yourself a better charger. I had uh not so great experience with that uh, charger itself um, the diffs are st uh, there's still gears in the diffs it is like I said a five fifty uh, mega brush motor in it. Uh, it's a waterproof SLT 2-in-1 25-amp ESC. Waterproof S660 uh, digital servo 84 ounces. Plastic gears. That's one upgrade I would do. It does have the EC3s uh, for the smart technology, but you don't really need it. It's, there's no smart technology in, uh, in IMH batteries. But, <clears throat> again, it comes with a Spectrum remote. It is an RTR. This is something different what they did normally from their own vehicles. Uh, let's take a look around the vehicle, then I'll show you what I mean. It is beefed up. Like I said, very non-hard tires. Um, that's why I say it is basically a monster truck, just the way it's the design. Beefed up, uh, basically bumpers. Drive shafts are very beefed up. That should pretty much handle a lot of stuff. Let's remove the body and see what's inside. But before we take a look inside, Let's take a look at the body clips. Some would say, yeah, it's body clip, list. No, it's not. It's one mega clip. And it's only one that you pass through, front and rear. Could you just put four of them? Yes, you could. The way it's designed, you could. This is, it's, I, I, I do like it. <clears throat> Two body clips. It's seriously awesome. Now looking inside, you do have the motor here. Uh, this, I'm almost ready to say you can put a fan in it to cool down the motor if it does come hot. You do have the two-in-one speed control with the EC built in. A lot easier to less parts in the vehicle uh, especially if you're giving this to a younger kid uh, you do have your servos your oil shocks for the battery tray it's clipless again and you just press on both sides able to lift it and take it out and remove your battery that I like the old design they had in the past with um, the body pin going side by side always used to jam jam up and you had a hard time removing it every time. But this I like. Now how is this going to handle in the cold? Not sure. Because we are in Canada here and we do have harsh winters. But again. Easy to work too if you ever need to change the uh, the pinion, not the pinion, but the uh, 
the spur. Easy access, that I do like. Don't need to dismantle the complete vehicle to work on it. But yeah, this is the Gorgon, Gorgon, whatever the name is, from Arma. Uh, if you guys have any questions or comments, post them below. I'll be glad to answer you guys. And don't forget to check out Great Hobbies. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. I do appreciate it. It does help the channel. And thank you for watching.